Hello, I am back with another episode of The Ballet Show. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of Season 4 Finale. Season Finale. Um, episode, season 4 will end this month. Um, I'm going to take a two-month break from uh, seasons. And um, uh, probably take a two-month break from making videos for a little while. Uh, I've been making videos a lot. Well, not a lot, but a lot this year, this month, last month, and the month before that. Uh, season four started, I think, in you know, October, and then December, and then January, and then. No, I think it started in December. I don't know. Like I said, it's weird, but season finale of uh, season four is this month, uh, probably the end of February. Um, I'm going to have one cameo by a buddy of mine, his name's Iceman, he was on an episode once we were talking about debates about superstars and stuff, we're just going to be talking about superheroes, movies, and shit, and you give me an option of what you want me and my buddy Chris to talk about. My nickname for him is Iceman, his nickname for me is Striker. He's the best in the world. I'm the greatest of all time. Copywritten bitch, don't take it. Well, best in the world's already taken. Greatest of all time is mine. Fuckers. Fuckers. No. Um, I wanted to do a shout out to Danny Galvez. Awesome, awesome that you have like a million, six, a billion subscribers. I know you don't, but I'm just saying. That's awesome. I'm happy for you, dude. Good. Hey. Contact me, Snapchat, dude. You know, I've been Snapchatting you and you haven't done anything back. I'm getting kind of sad. Yeah. Um, I'll hit you up soon, buddy. Uh, I want to do a shout out to I am the game HHH. What's up? I haven't really seen nothing from you yet, but just want to do a shout out because I miss talking to you guys. Uh, Mace World. What's up? He's contacted me about my belt, but I don't know. I've been iffy about it. Um, I am talking to this dude on his website called uh, MD Championship Belts. He's got them pretty. They make their own belts. You can ask a belt and they'll make it for you and they'll ship it to you at a reasonable price. So I've been talking to them. Hopefully I can get my uh, my, my custom made belt that I want. Uh, I'm going to get a Valley Show custom made belt. It's going to be cool as shit. Either that or I'm going to get any radical looking belt. Um, or just get a custom made belt that's gonna look badass. Uh, um, let's see. Rumor has it that Dwayne DeRock Johnson has signed up to be John Stewart Green Lantern, the black Green Lantern, not racism, just saying the black Green Lantern, in the upcoming sequel to Man of Steel, known as Superman or Batman vs. Superman, whatever the fuck the title is. They should call it Man of Steel 2 World's Finest because all the world's finest super superheroes come together. Making cameos in the movie is uh, Green Lantern, uh, The Flash, and uh, maybe The Flash, I don't know. I think it's just going to be Green Lantern and uh, Wonder Woman. And then there, and Jesse Eisenberg as Lex Luthor, which is cool, you know, whatever, I'm not picky. Dude, it's a Superman movie. Do you think I'd give a shit? I'm just stoked that they're, they're making another one. But it's a shame that they're not going to make it in 2015 because Ben Affleck kind of hurt his shoulder. Well, it's not your fault, man. I understand. Cool. I have not seen the new Batsuit. They won't fucking show it. Uh, so, yeah, I want to see what the new Batman suit looks like. If it's, I hope it doesn't look shitty. And I heard that Ben Affleck's willing, willing to reboot the Batman series. I'm like, why are they rebooting it? Just continue it. Continue it after where Kristen Bell left. Say, like, Kristen Bell makes a cameo and says, Hey, if you want to be the new Batman, you do it. And then Kristen Bell's out and Ben Affleck's in. See, don't don't reboot it. Continue it. The Dark Knight returns. See, be like, it goes, Batman begins, Dark Knight. The Dark Knight rises. The Dark Knight returns. Dark Knight, blah, blah, blah. They should keep doing it. Because there's still other villains out there. Like, there's fucking Penguin. There's Riddler. Fucking, 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 um, uh, oh, who's the fucking, Deathstroke, they, they, 
They can fucking be do. They can do Batman Origins movie. Fucking. You know, they, they Black Mask. Fucking. They can bring back the Joker. What the fuck? What? Uh, I think they should bring Kristen Bell as a cameo. If they do reboot the Batman series, or if they do continue it, make it Dark Knight Returns. Say he was gone for a year and he comes back as an, a different Batman, but they, a different Batman is here, but the guy's not. He's like, well, I'm a friend of Bruce, so I took over the Wayne Enterprise, and he's, you know, he takes over Wayne Enterprise, blah blah blah, and yeah, he takes the name and identity of Bruce Wayne, because. Chris Bill comes back, he's like, look, you want to be Batman, you want to be Bruce Wayne, I give my identity to you, and you are the new Batman, and you see him storming off with Selena Kyle. <laughs> no. I don't know what they're going to do. Uh, a lot of people are saying they're going to reboot the Ghost Rider movies, which is stupid. Why? Ghost Rider is badass. And they're rebooting Green Lantern. I can understand that, but Ryan Reynolds did an awesome job as fucking Green Lantern, dude. Come on, give him a break. This dude tried his damnness to make a good superhero movie. And you dog him. What the fuck? Whatever. Anyway. Um, like I said, as long as I see fucking Superman in a movie, I'm fucking stoked. Because, you know, they're making these Marvel movies so fucking much, dude. Like... You got you got Amazing Spider-Man 2 coming out. You got Captain America 2, The Winter Soldier. You already got fucking Thor's coming out on DVD soon. Uh, the second one. Uh, you got a t they're in talks of an Ant-Man. Like Ant-Man? Really? He's like this big. It's like oh, all dead. <laughs> You're gonna fight me. I'm gonna eat you. Oh, done. Movie's over. End credits. Yeah. <laughs> Nick Fury comes in at the end. I'm here to recruit Ant-Man. Well, get in line because he's in my belly. He's in my belly. I'll shut him out for you. If you want. <laughs> here. No. Nipple. Anyway. Um. Yeah. Um. They're actually getting ready to do Avengers 2. Which my reason is they should do a Planet Hulk after Avengers 2 because they haven't really done a Hulk movie. But what I was thinking is when they do a Planet Hulk and World War Hulk, um, the Hulk gets out of control. They're trying to, you know, calm him down because he's so angry and, you know, they're fighting him. And they sh just, just jets him into a different planet. And that's where it goes, Planet Hulk. And he's on a different planet fighting all these monsters. Which, I'm surprised he can fucking breathe on this planet. And then he returns to Earth in World War Hulk. And he brings off his alien buddies to fight the Avengers because they turned on him. So, I think that'd be a pretty cool plot. That's my opinion. Um, in Captain America 2, he gets a black outfit. Whatever. Um, Robocop's coming out this month, which I'm stoked because I want to see Robocop. When I found out they're remaking Robocop, I'm like, oh, dude! But they made him black. He's gray. I think eventually he goes back to being gray, but still, he's, he's black? Really? Go buy the original, buddy. He's gray. They made three of them. And they made a series, which didn't really last long, but still. Robocop, dude. Robocop's a badass. Half man, half robot. Come with me if you want to live. Dead or alive, you're coming with me. Um... And I heard they're rebooting the fucking Terminator movies. They're calling the next Terminator Genesis. Um, or Generation. Something like that. Um, I'm like, why reboot them? Come on. It's cool if you continue them. You know? Because it gives you more of a plot. We're so used to we're so used to being at Terminator Salvation. I was like, okay, is John Connor alive? Is he going to return? You know? No. We're gonna, how about this? We're just going to reboot it. Apparently, there's going to be a Ghost Rider chick who's going to be the main Ghost Rider. What? 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 No. No, no. No. Keep it as a dude. Keep it Ghost Rider, dude. Make Ghost Rider 3, dude. Make it badass. Don't make him fight a better fucking villain. Like, somebody huge. Don't reboot the Green Lanterns. Continue it. 
say Hal Jordan disappeared and John Stewart came to save the day. What the fuck? Don't reboot him. Continue. Yeah, I don't know. They did the same thing for fucking Superman Returns. That movie didn't get a lot of fucking buzz. It was Brandon Ross' first time as Superman. In my opinion, he did a good job. It's my opinion. But they didn't make a lot. I saw that movie four times in theaters. I've watched Man of Steel 28 times. I even have the Blu ray now. I, I've been watching it. Or watching it, everybody. And I already have the movie, the regular version. But I haven't seen the Blu ray because they said there was four hours of additional footage. Where in the movie is it at? I mean, come on. But, anyway. I think that's a different Blu ray, so I fucking. I don't know. I might just buy it for my mom, my dad, my mom, and watch it then. But, huh. Anyway, um. I'm just so stoked that they're making a Superman movie. I mean, yeah, his outfit looks awesome and shit. But there's no red, there's no yellow bone. I mean, it's like the Amazing Spider-Man. He updates his outfit, which is fine. It's cool. If Man of Steel 2 comes in and he makes a different outfit, keeps the same symbol, but updates his outfit, cool. I want the yellow symbol on the back of the cape. That's all I care about. Just go original. That's all I care about. You don't have to have the, the little spandex, you know, underwear. Just have the belt and, yeah. You know, whatever. I don't know. I'm just, I'm a huge Superman fan. I just don't want them to ruin the second one. They didn't ruin the first one, which the first one was badass, which I saw three times in theaters, and then I've been watching it. I've watched it 28 times. Yeah, eight. 28 times. I've watched Hancock when that first came out five, five times. Five. I saw it three times in theaters. Three. Oh, hit the wrong finger, too. But I saw Thor twice. I saw Catching Fire twice. Yeah. I saw fucking all... Okay, don't judge me, but I saw all four of the fucking Branky or uh, Twilight movies. When I had a girlfriend, and they liked it. <gasps> Edward! You're so sparkly. Hey, I'm a wolf. I'm CGI. They don't have good werewolf movies anymore. The only good werewolf movie they have is Wolfman, and they should continue that fucking movie. Wolfman was a fucking movie. Now that's a werewolf movie. A dude dressed in a wolf outfit. <sighs> Do that against a vampire, and the vampire is fucked. I'm a huge vampire fan, I'm a huge fucking werewolf fan, I'm a huge horror fan, like, I like horror movies, I like people getting stabbed in the face. I like people getting ripped apart, you know, I like Transformers, you know, the fucking cars, I wish my car was a Transformer, dude, you know how cool that'd be? Oh yeah, this is my uh, car, Yellowtron, or Banana Peel, whatever the fuck, because my car's yellow. Why not? Everybody calls it the Banana Mobile anyway, so might as well. Banana Mobile. The Banana Tron. Bumblebee. Whatever. Fucking. Uh, that's my opinion, but. Oh. I guess I'll end this on the note. See you all later. I will make another episode too. Another episode to this one. Uh, be on the lookout for the season finale at the end of this month. I'm going to make it all out. I'm going to do stunts of the day. Uh, uh, getting hit in the stomach by a sledgehammer by Triple H. I fucking wish. That'd be cool. No. I want to get RKO'd on a snow. That'd be pretty cool. I want to get, like, body slammed or suplex on a snow. So that'd be pretty cool. All right, y'all. I'll uh, see y'all later. Fizzle.